சென்னை மெட்ரோ ரயில் முதல் கட்ட திட்டத்தின் விரிவாக்கத்தை மாண்புமிகு பாரத பிரதமர் அவர்கள் கொடியசைத்து துவக்கி வைக்கிறார் தி ஆனரபிள் பிரைம் மினிஸ்டர் will flag off the train on the extended phase 1 of the Chennai metro rail service from Washington Pet to Vimkonagar which covers a length of 9.05 km with seven stations. A short film on the project will now be played. Our Honorable Prime Minister has always emphasized on the creation of modern infrastructure to aid in new India. There has been an unprecedented growth in metro network in India in the last six years. Improving the ease of living for people is realized by our Honorable Chief Minister through various flagship projects such as Chennai Metro Rail and a host of schemes. Chennai Metro Rail project, in addition to its existing Phase 1 operations, is to commence its services from Washington Pet to Vimkonaga in North Chennai for a further 9.05 kilometers along the Blue Line Corridor with two underground and five elevated stations built at a cost of Rs. 3,770 crores with the financial assistance from Government of India, Government of Tamil Nadu and China. Inching its network to 54 kilometers in the green and blue line corridors with 39 stations to facilitate seamless travel, improved mobility, less travel time and reduced carbon dioxide emission. About 2 lakh people are expected to commute every day by Chennai Metro in this stretch. After this, Chennai Metro Rail with its ambitious Phase 2 project will reach the entire city. It will transform Chennai into a world class destination for investments, tourism and economic activities. Chennai Metro, Ungan Metro. சென்னை திட்டங்களை மாண்புமிகு பாரத பிரதமர் அவர்கள் கொடியசைத்து நாட்டுக்கு அர்ப்பணிக்கிறார் The Honourable Prime Minister will flag off the train and dedicate the fourth railway line from Chennai Beach to Atipattu and the newly electrified Vinapuram Tanjavur Tiruvaru single line sections to the nation. A short audiovisual recording on the future development is being given top priority by the Narendra Modi government. People friendly and growth friendly decisions have been taken. The call for Atmanirbhar Bharat, self-reliant India, will ensure economic strength and integrating with road and rail infrastructure. Thank you.